All right, YouTube, what's up? We're going to get right into it. So this is called the nail and string art. First, I started off by getting all my material. I had about six different colors that I needed, and I had a lot of thumbtacks. Um, so the first thing I did was draw my design. As you can see, I don't know if you guys can see it. So after I drew my design, I then started putting thumbtacks in everywhere basically every three inches or wherever there was a point that needed a thumbtack um after that i started outlining with the yarn i'm using yarn by the way it's not like regular string it's just regular yarn you get from any arts and crafts store or walmart or anything but i started using yarn um i just tied the end to a thumbtack and then I just started weaving and going crazy with it as you can see with the T right there and then I did the outline with the white there's no specific pattern I did this in I just went pick the thumbtack and then made the string go across the in the color uh, just to basically fill it in the more the more like vibrant the color is the better it'll look And that's basically all it is to it. Um, it took me a very long time to make it because of how big it was. But if you have like a simple design design with less colors um, and way smaller than what this is, then it will probably be a lot easier. But I hope you enjoy the rest of this time lapse. Thank you. And also note that it's always good to have somebody help you. It'll save you a lot of time and effort. Thanks to my cameraman who stepped from behind the camera to help me out. Show me some new moves. 
She got that ooh ooh. I'ma have Goku. She got that ooh ooh. Baby, she's so cool. Show me some moo moo. I'ma have Goku. Performing like Hoku. She got that ooh ooh. She got that ooh ooh. Yeah, this old diamond does it. She a diamond plus she fine as fuck. Uh, she remind me of one of the islands where she wanted up. Uh, call this plug, cause I plug a hose. Call a fire truck, she explode with me like a hose. Some people may be satisfied about like how it looks right now, but knowing me, I was not satisfied. I wanted it a lot darker. So I just went over every color again, basically adding a new layer of yarn. So that's why the blue is a lot darker and the yellow is a lot darker and the green. And I'm working on the red right now. So this is basically the finished product. I went over all the black and all the white again so it could be more dark. Um, it took me a very long time. It took me almost about five days, about four hours a day, like on and off. It took me almost about a thousand thumb thumbtacks. And over about a thousand yards of yarn.